Hello guys, welcome back to Bhavsak YouTube channel. So in today's video, we are going to discuss about the most important labs which are required to enhance your practical hacking skills. Many of you have been asking me on Instagram and YouTube which resources we should follow to really get into cybersecurity more practical way. So today's video is all about that. Let's get started. Let's start with today's first platform and that's TryHackMe. TryHackMe is a really beginner friendly platform for everyone. Just go to Hacktivities and then change difficult level to easy will show you all the easy rooms. If you are a total beginner, you don't have any knowledge about penetration testing and hacking, here are some of the easy rooms which I will recommend you for all the beginners. You can start with Learn Linux, Linux Challenges and Introductory Researching and Map. Let's move further to the next difficulty level and that's medium. Medium consists of little bit tough challenges than easy but believe me you can do that all. Here are some of the rooms like reverse engineering, windows privilege escalation, active directory and a lot more. And change the difficulty level to hard will show you all the hard rooms which are really made for the pro hackers. The more rooms you will complete, more knowledge you will get and more harder labs you can try in the future. After completing some of these labs, you will get badges and levels. As you can see, this is my public profile. This rank is 3453 because I just started only 2 weeks before on this platform. Here are all the badges which I have earned by completing the rooms. Let's move further to the next platform and that's Hack the Box. It's quite popular among the hackers and pro players. Just click on login and this will show you a cool looking dashboard. If you are a total beginner on this platform, just click starting point. The starting point will help you to get familiar with hack the box and get started on it. You need to install VirtualBox or any security operating system for example Kali Linux or Paratoos. I will recommend you downloading these platforms because you will be hacking in a safe environment. So don't end up hacking your own files and encrypting all your personal data. Just click next and we'll show you the VPN connection page. Just download the connection pack and open that connection pack with OpenVPN. This will connect your own machine with hack the box servers. So you can access to the various machines and play challenges on it. Now it's time to see which challenges are really good for the beginners. Just click on challenges and we'll show you all the wide category of challenges which you can play. For example, clicking on web will show all the web challenges. All you have to do is Connect to VPN, click on these challenges, start instance and find the flag. After finding the flag, just paste it here and click submit. After that you will be rewarded more points. The more points you will earn, the more higher you will get on the scoreboard. Now let's move further to our next platform and that's VWAP. VWAP is an extremely buggy web application made for bug hunters and web app pen testers. As you can see, it consists more than 100 web vulnerabilities based on WASP top 10. After clicking on bug section, we'll introduce you all the bugs you can find in this web application. It will start you through from SQL injection, HTML, iframe, and after that going to cross-site scripting and CSRF. And this buggy web application consists of a lot more bugs you can keep learning. If you want to download this buggy web application, just click on download and it will show you BWAP link here. You can run this BWAP files on your Apache server. Or you can download a BBOX and run it on your VirtualBox software. Now let's move further to our next lab and that's Wasp Security Shepherd. This is a quite cool lab you can play with your own friends under the same network. Here are some of the play modules you can play like open floor mode, tournament mode and CTF mode. This lab is made on OWASP top 10 vulnerabilities. After clicking on the features, we'll show you all the features which are inside this lab. You can install this lab on Docker, virtual machine or by manual methods after following these links. If you need a tutorial on installing these labs, just comment down below and I will make another video for you. Let's see our next lab and that's DVWA. DVWA is a damn web printable application which you can run on your Apache server and start finding bugs on it. You can download this web application from the download link and all of these labs links are in my description below. Just click there and download these labs and start working on. 
Let's see our next lab and that's OWASP WebCode. WebCode is a really nice project by OWASP Foundation. Just click on goals and we'll show you all the goals which are required to do. Just click on lessons, we'll walk you through all the topics which have been covered in this lab. As you can see, almost all the topics are covered on OWASP top 10 vulnerabilities. And this is the base of your cybersecurity career. At last, I just want you to say if you have any queries regarding these labs about setting up or completing up or you are stuck somewhere, just go to sacarmy.org platform, click on discussions and start your topic here. Our community will try to help you as soon as possible and there are a lot members which will help you to grow further. You can follow this discord link which will invite you to our sacarmy infosec community.